Do we have any fans of robot boxing here today? We're in the year 2020, and robot boxing is the biggest sport in the world. That was awesome. Corporate sponsored, big money, rules, regulations, but beyond that is the underworld. Give me the main event. Fight till the death! I just need a little longer. As much as I like you, dude, you're a bad bet, brother. What was he like? As a boxer? As anything. Charlie is someone who was a boxer. Boxing is no longer relevant. People aren't interested in it anymore. Robot boxing is a game, and he's trying to eke out a living. You're finally done because you got nothing left. What are we looking for? Anything. Anything I could use to put a fighting bot together. I think there's a whole robot in there. Max finds Adam in this junkyard, and he believes that there's something to this robot. I've never seen anything like it before. When we bring him to life, it's probably the most important moment in the entire film. Adam becomes the glue that brings us all together. Get him a fight. The robots are operated by humans. They have remote controls, control panels, high-tech devices. Adam's big-time function is the shadow function, and his operating system is programmed to mirror what he sees. Watch me do what I do. We did motion capture where we had real boxers choreographed by Sugar Ray Leonard actually boxing each other. Sean said to me, he goes, how do you feel about Sugar Ray Leonard? And I was like, sure, why don't we just go for the best? The emotion takes over in this thing and all of a sudden these machines, it's like they come to life and you start talking to them like they're real. Show them some power. And that's what the audience are gonna feel too. I'm ready to fight. Steel.